EastEnders delivers yet another jaw-dropping murder revelation, leaving viewers on the edge. Linda exposes Keanu's demise to a shocked Johnny, leading to a frantic search for the murder weapon. Amidst the chaos, the show's schedule faces a shakeup, while another actor bids farewell to Walford. Meanwhile, a new twist emerges in Jay's storyline, as doubts about paternity loom large. With yet another shocking murder twist, EastEnders pulls the rug out from under us. There are spoilers in this post for Monday's EastEnders episode, which you can view on BBC iPlayer right now even though it hasn't yet broadcast on television. When we thought this plot could get any more shocking, EastEnders has revealed yet another shocking development for the six that could mean the end for them all. When Linda Carter eventually told Johnny Carter the terrible truth about Christmas Day, we were astounded last week. She shocked him by telling him that Keanu Taylor had been strangling Sharon Watts, and that she had tried to stop him, but he had died as a result. In the episode airing today, Johnny insisted that Linda give him a detailed explanation of everything. Linda dutifully walked him through the sequence of events, including how they had eventually hidden Keanu's body under the cafe. The whole thing appalled Johnny, and his concerns only increased when Linda disclosed that the murder weapon was still under her bed. In an attempt to resolve the situation, he insisted that she summon the remaining members of the six and assured them that they would dispose of the murder weapon that evening. The remainder of the six were taken aback when they saw Johnny at the barrel store, but they maintained their facade until he confessed that he had known Keanu was dead. Without a question, the six were incensed that Linda had violated the vow and were concerned about who else she would end up telling. But when Johnny revealed that they shouldn't be concerned about Linda, things simply became worse. The women remained terrified that the weapon had not yet been rid of when he disclosed that he had completely searched Linda's room beneath her bed in an attempt to find it. Without a question, the six were incensed that Linda had violated the vow and were concerned about who else she would end up telling. But when Johnny revealed that they shouldn't be concerned about Linda, things simply became worse. The women remained terrified that the weapon had not yet been rid of when he disclosed that he had completely searched Linda's room beneath her bed in an attempt to find it. Why has the BBC One soap opera EastEnders been cancelled for this week? EastEnders was removed from TV guide listings and will not air this week at its regular time. On Thursday, April 18, the long-running BBC One soap opera was removed from the TV schedule. Since an hour-long episode is scheduled for Wednesday, EastEnders has been cancelled for this Thursday. Every week, from Monday through Thursday, from 7.30pm to 8pm, EastEnders airs on television. On the other hand, an hour-long program commemorating Lucy Beale's death will air on the soap opera. This indicates that the show scheduled for Thursday has been cancelled. On Thursday, April 18, the long-running BBC One soap opera was removed from the TV schedule. Since an hour-long episode is scheduled for Wednesday, EastEnders has been cancelled for this Thursday. Every week, from Monday through Thursday, from 7.30pm to 8pm, EastEnders airs on television. On the other hand, an hour-long program commemorating Lucy Beale's death will air on the soap opera. This indicates that the show scheduled for Thursday has been cancelled. On Thursday, April 18, the long-running BBC One soap opera was removed from the TV schedule. Since an hour-long episode is scheduled for Wednesday, EastEnders has been cancelled for this Thursday. Every week, from Monday through Thursday, from 7.30pm to 8pm, EastEnders airs on television. On the other hand, an hour-long program commemorating Lucy Beale's death will air on the soap opera. This indicates that the show scheduled for Thursday has been cancelled. Say anything you want. Please share your thoughts with us by leaving a comment below. The hour-long show airing on Wednesday night will also introduce the Yolanda Truman sexual assault narrative. Next week, the soap will resume on its regular schedule. Monday through Thursday at 7.30 p.m. on BBC One or BBC iPlayer, EastEnders airs. Reporter Natalie Dixon covers lifestyle for National World. You can follow Natalie Dixon on X by clicking this link if you enjoyed this post and would like to read more about soap operas, celebs, and lifestyle. Additionally, you can subscribe to her free weekly fashion and beauty column, which is published every Wednesday in the National World Today email and has all the most recent fashion and beauty news. Astonishingly, an EastEnders performer named Ender the Road has resigned after five years. To seek other opportunities, the star is leaving the BBC soap opera.
After five years on EastEnders, actor Clay Milner Russell has left the show. The actor, who portrays Bobby Beale on the BBC serial opera, is leaving the show with the intention of taking on challenging new roles outside of Walford, as The Sun can exclusively disclose. Elliot Carrington left the role of Killer Kid Bobby in 2019, and Clay, 24, is the fifth actor to play Bobby. Watchers have witnessed Clay's portrayal of Bobby return to Walford following his stay in a juvenile detention facility following the murder of his sister Lucy Beale. Bobby had a tense reunion with Lucy's mother Cindy Beale, converted to Islam, and experienced a breakdown while having images of his dead sister since returning to Walford. Following Anna Knight's infidelity with his best buddy Freddie Slater, the character is currently seeing his stepsister. But actor Clay has now chosen to leave the soap opera to explore other roles after years in the square. Clay is a talented actor and he's ambitious, a source claimed that he had no intention of remaining in EastEnders indefinitely. Though he enjoys portraying Bobby, he wants to play a variety of parts as that is why he became an actor. It's goodbye for now, but the door will remain open. We can confirm that Clay will be leaving EastEnders later on this year, and we wish him the best for the future, an EastEnders spokesman said in a statement confirming the news. Clay is a young actor so he wants to use these years to try his hand at other roles, the insider continued IT was really tough for him to make that choice because he truly likes working on EastEnders and has made a lot of wonderful friends there. However, since joining the cast in 2019, he feels that the timing is now appropriate to look into other opportunities. Actor Max Bowden was recently let go from his role as Ben Mitchell on EastEnders. Ben was extradited to serve a six-year prison term after being detained for fraud he committed in America. Actress Shona McGarty, who departed from her role as Whitney Dean, will go shortly as well. It's not Jay Brown who is set to expose manipulative Nadine Keller on EastEnders. Recently, Nadine Keller made a surprise appearance on TV, revealing a shocking revelation about Jay Brown on EastEnders. When she disclosed that she was pregnant and that the child was his, Jay was utterly shocked, but in later moments, he starts to have his doubts. Jay invites Nadine to 29B after being given some food for thought, and they soon begin rowing. Nadine continues to tell Jay that the baby is his, even when he questions the paternity of the child. She then announces that they are expecting a daughter. Jay gives her some cash and promises to be there for her and the baby despite his first reservations. Actor Jamie Borthwick said, I think he steps up to the responsibility that he doesn't want. Everyone is familiar with Jay, Perry Fenwick describes him as a good man. He therefore undoubtedly fulfills his responsibility. I believe he has become enmeshed in this. He accepts this. He is fully in favor of it because he is a decent man and has no reason to doubt it. He also responds positively when needed. When Nadine visits the family the following day, she apologizes for upsetting Lexi Pierce about the pregnancy, but she is filled with guilt when she realizes how much this baby means to Jay. Jay takes Lexi and Nadine out to lunch at the Queen Vic in an attempt to mend fences. But when Lexi starts talking without holding back, things start to become obvious that a rift is starting to grow. Is Nadine planning something, and is Lexi about to reveal it? Please subscribe our channel.